Nice when you're original. When you're nice when you're seven two tigers don't die from beagles. Oh no, they do not die from beagles. See? It's in the song. It's in the song. So beagles can not kill seven two tigers. There we go. Hello once again from the Tokyo jungle, my Jade Warriors. Isaac here, finally back. Finally, I've returned to you, my long lost YouTube. Oh my god, I love you. I missed you so much. And I missed all my awesome Jade Warriors. Thank you so much, guys, for tuning back in for more content after such a long hiatus. But trust me, I'm back now. This room is dedicated to nothing but making content. For my awesome jade warriors so stay tuned there's going to be tons of content coming in the near future and there have been a lot of shenanigans with moving in and i'm going to regale you guys with some of those tales today while we play through another episode of survival mode so you guys have been really really digging these dlc characters we've had another request by our jade warrior the Lion King Robloxian, awesome, awesome name, to play through another DLC character, the Sabretooth Tiger, and in honor of this request, and the first episode in forever, I've, I've put on my little Sabretooth inspired headdress here. Look at that, my little cap, my winter cap, seeing as it's getting so cold now in Tokyo, guys. I've got my little winter cap on with the kitty ears in honor of the Sabretooth Tiger playthrough. So! This episode will go down in infamy. You will remember me being crazy, wearing my ears, and welcoming all you awesome guys back to more J-Hope VG. So, without further ado, let's get started. Jump into Shibuya. Sadly, I don't live near Shibuya no more, no guys. Yeah, it's, uh, it's about an hour away now. You know, it was about 10 minutes down the road before, but now it's more than an hour away. So, it will be missed. I freaking will miss Shibuya. The closest thing I'll have to it now is looking at it digitally here in Tokyo Jungle. But that's okay. Plenty of pleasant memories up here, guys. I'm not going to forget the place anytime soon. Anyway, let's get started by checking out the channel list as always. Uh, while I've been on hiatus, guys, I've jumped into Tokyo Jungle quite a few times. I've managed to complete every challenge on one animal. Can you guess what it was? It was the Ponoramian, yes. So we've got ourselves a little tuxedo now that we can chuck onto a character. And uh, what do we got here? We've got prayer beads for completing all the A-level challenges on the Sabertooth Tiger. And anything else? No, but damn, son, I want those prayer beads. Mm -hmm. Hold on to your kitty hats, guys, if you're wearing your own, because we are going to get those prayer beads today. We need to make a plenty of wishes to whatever animal god these saber-toothed tigers worship, because we have got to get tuxedos for all of our animals in the long run, don't we, guys? <laughs> it's going to be a very formal ending of the world. Mankind will be shown to the door, the back door, with all the new occupants, all the animals of the Animal Kingdom, wearing tuxedos, 007 style. God damn, I want to see that new 007 movie, guys. It's getting tons of praise. Uh, but anyway, I'm getting off track already. First objective, head to Shibuya Woods and change generation one time. So, this is my first time playing the Sabertooth Tiger. I'm pretty sure he's not a herbivore. No, sorry, Bob. He does not like a garden salad. Like our salary man did in the last episode. No, he has a thirst for blood. Because I think, as I said in the last episode, the Sabertooth Tiger is the vampire of the animal kingdom. <laughs> oh yes, he loves the pork. He loves to eat the pork. Maybe on the side of a bowl of ramen. Yes, like all good vampires. <laughs> Freaking Teoenticos buffet! All these animals have lined up for me. Oh, fantastic! I wonder what uh, I wonder what a saber-toothed tiger would have tasted like, guys. What would have our 
Homo erectus ancestors have thought of the texture of the saber-toothed tiger meat. I very much do wonder. I should probably piddle here while I'm while I'm in the area. I should just piddle a little bit, get it out of my system, as it were. But damn, this saber-toothed tiger seems to be moving pretty damn slow. It's got a considerable amount of stamina, though. I wonder if he can enter the sewers. Probably not. He's a pretty big ass animal and I mean that in the kindest way that is one big ass and not not a fat ass that's a nice toon ass hmm that that saber tooth bat tiger he's been working out all right goodbye wolf oh were you yelling at me golden retriever come on bring it boy you think you stand a chance son no you don't no you don't not against teeth like these, the only person that stands a chance against me is a freaking elephant! Cause he's the only one in the freaking kingdom who's got teeth longer than mine! Damn son, I can't eat that chicken! Yeah, a plate, a pallet full of little chickens would make a very nice hors d'oeuvre for a saber tooth tiger like myself. Mm -hmm. That looks like someone walking around on two feet up here, is it? Ah, oh, it's a chimpanzee. Ah, it was a chimpanzee. Cause it ain't no more, he's just a splatter on the sidewalk now. No he's not, he's a pile of bones. Damn, he lost weight first. Speaking of losing weight, I just went to my first workout at the local gym today, guys. I'm settled in enough in my new place now that I can start organizing gym membership and whatnot. Oh, more hors d'oeuvres, fantastic. Ah, it's so good to be going back to the gym, guys. This whole area where I am now located is just amazing. Uh, I don't actually, I don't know if I've said it before. Oh, oops, I went to sleep. I haven't done that before. Is that a good or a bad thing? I'm not sure if that's a good or a bad thing or not. Oh, I haven't actually tried going to sleep before, but the ramification seems that uh, it's created rain. Damn. I should try sleeping more in Australia, if that's the ramification of sleeping. More rain. Oh, look at that sexy, sexy saber-toothed tiger, bitch. I don't know, what do you call a female saber-toothed tiger? Oh, do I, no, I don't really want her. I've become very choosy, guys, in my playing of Tokyo Jungle. I want nothing but the best for my lead characters. So, matter of facto, I only want the prime females. The ones that have taken the time to cover themselves with glitter. Not you! You're a dirty skag! Ugh, keep away. Oh, God. No. And speaking of beautiful women, I need to make myself a beautiful man by putting on some clothes. Let's see what we've got here. Yes, yes, antennas. That'll definitely style me up. Oh, no. Mustache glass is definitely much more attractive. <laughs> now, antenna's the way to go. And a uh, head girl school scarf? No, he's a. Oh, headphones. Hell yeah. Damn, this, this freaking saber tooth tiger is just a walking freaking media center. Look at that. He's got headphones, antennas. What else can we stick on this, son bitch? Let's see what else we got here. Anything else? Backpack. There we go. He is set. Man. Shit, son. You are freaking. Pimped for taking on this freaking game. He's gonna pawn the likes of anything that stands in his way. Bring it. Damn. Saber to Tiger. He's ready for the gym himself. I should have to ride him there myself next time I head there, which will be tomorrow morning. I'm gonna hit the gym hard, guys. I'm gonna be looking nice and buff. And within three to four months, you just wait. You wait. Mm hmm. Ain't gonna lift my shirt now, but you just stay tuned. Before we finished all these episodes, all these animal playthroughs of Tokyo Jungle, I'm gonna be buff as a freaking saber-toothed tiger wearing a girl scarf. You know it. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, bunny rabbit. Delicious. Have any of you guys ever tried rabbit before? I've heard it's pretty good. Very popular in France. And apparently they come stuffed with presents. Can't complain about that. I like any food that surprises me at the end of the meal. Especially, you know, Chinese food. Those fortune cookies, they're just like, SURPRISE! You will die in three days! Oh, thank you, fortune cookie. I really appreciate the heads up. And by knowing that, 
I can avoid it! There you go, and it doesn't happen! Isn't that awesome? Oh, more hors d'oeuvres. Now, if only every meal came with a fortune cookie or advice on how to live your life. Stop wasting your life by eating fatty foods like you just ate. Or stop wasting your life by playing Tokyo Jungle when you get home, because you know that's exactly what you're going to do. Wow, this fortune cookie knows me so well. How does it know so much about me? It's a miracle! Actually, it would be pretty scary if uh, fortune cookies knew my name, my hobbies, my place of birth, and everything else. It would be quite unnerving. But who knows, with social media these days, that could be very well what is in the cards. Especially with Sabertooth Tigers dressing up like this, that's definitely in the cards, I think. Alright, anyway, I was talking about moving house. So, if any of you guys have ever tried moving house before, in a different language, like I have in Japanese, please let me know in the comments below. Let me know what your, your experience was. Oh, look at that! She's a prime female, she's ready for some action. She's ready for the new age of social media. Uh, apparently not. I'm not fashionable yet. I'm not buff enough yet. My ass, it's not big enough yet. Damn it, I'm gonna have to go kill some animals to make myself more appealing to that lovely, lovely prime female. But let me just check here where all the food's at. Oh damn, lucky I checked because I was just about to head to the shop district and there ain't no food there, son. There's some in Dogenzaka, but Shibuya Woods is the place to be. But I don't know if I'm going to get there and back in time to create my first generation. Ah, no. Oh, well, we'll just head to Dogenzaka for now and see how we go. And even if we fail one or two challenges, it's okay, guys. As long as we get those prayer beads. That's all that matters. Come on, girl. Come on. Can't you compromise? Can't you compromise just a little bit? Lower your standards. You know, wash up a, off a little bit of that glitter and maybe I'll be more on your level. I know that's expensive glitter, but you know, we can't all afford to waste so much income on frivolous things like glitter. Ah, uh, well, maybe if I head to one of the gay nightclubs in the local area, they'll have some glitter to spare. Hello! Anyone with glitter? Glitter to spare? I will pay handsomely. Oh, another prime female! Holy crap, the Shibuya station's full of freaking prime females. I've got to remember that next time I head to Shibuya. Just hang around the freaking station for a little while. And I'll get all the goodies. Oh, there you go. Bagel, bagel. Enter in my gullet. Oh, more presents. Oh, wool beanie! If only that was any good. Oh, a pr how did I miss you? How did I miss you? I thought she was a dirty female? Something weird just happened there that I'm not quite familiar or comfortable with. Uh, but that's okay. That's what all these games are about. Learning the finer details. Alright, pet medicine. Excellent. Should I catch anything if I have to resort to some dirty females? Down the line! Ah, chimpanzees! They'll fill me up. There we go. Come on, just a couple more of you chimpanzees. Oh, dears. Be a deer. And get in my belly. It's very handy having these backpacks on my back because, you know, if I don't finish off the deer, I can just store it away for leftovers tomorrow when I go to work. There we go. There's my dinner. And my breakfast. I just got to store it away in my, in my leftover pouch. Beautiful. Thank you. I actually wanted him to call his mates because I want to kill more of them. I need more food to get sexy for those prime females and I don't have much time left. Whoa! What is wrong with these hyenas or jackals or whatever the hell these dog-like creatures are? You do not go up against a saber-toothed tiger for God's sakes. It's just stupidity. I'm pretty sure the animal's brains are big enough to realize that you don't take me on by your freaking self. Oh, something's gonna jump me from the uh, bushes. <laughs> See, that's more like it. This jackal had a brain and it was delicious. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Ah, look at that. We're right in front of a ramen shop. Can I have some ramen, please? Extra deary. <laughs> but yes, back to moving. 
it has been quite the difficulty dealing with gas people and city hall and everyone else in uh, in the uh, Tokyo, you know, hierarchy of government to make sure that all the oh shit, we've only got a couple of minutes left till ten. Um, oh, I don't want to fail. Oh shit, we're gonna fail. Oh. No tuxedo for me, it looks like, guys. I do apologize. But all that matters is that we get the A level challenges complete. Alright, we can do that. We're going to be able to do that, gang. Don't you worry your little selves about that. Oh, man. I should have just gone with a cheap female. I think the Saber Tooth Tiger needed more food. Probably because he's a bigger boy. He has a bigger stomach to fill. He needed more food. He's kind of like a cow. Maybe he has three or four stomachs that need to be filled. No, I don't care about you, you average female. Where's that lovely glittery female I saw before? But yeah, it's kind of weird. Like, I, I am studying Japanese, guys. Like, I, I do want to get as fluent as possible. Hey, you were prime! You were glittery! Did you wash the glitter off? Oh, man. The, the females must change their their uh, status after you leave the zone, I guess. Because this, this one coming up was definitely a prime female. I know it. And see, she's average now. <sighs> What's that about? That sucks. Ah. Ma. Five clean kills, one generation change, and claim the jackal territory. Where be ye jackals? I will find out in about five seconds as soon as that progresses to year 11. Come on, year 11. You're nearly there. I hope they're all in the Shibuya suburbs, because I feel like heading that way. There we go. Where are they at? Where are they at? Oh, shop district! Whew! I love it when it all comes together. See, the game loves me, guys, you know. It, it tries to, you know, teach me some tough love time to time. You know, with the challenges not being the most convenient in order, but it comes it comes to its own every now and then. Just like this is was supposed to be oh shit, a prime female, and then I went and grabbed an average female. What happened to all the prime females? God damn it, fine. <sighs> I guess I'll have sex with you if I have to. Uh, unless, unless you, oh no, you're still keen, you're still coming. All right, fine. <sighs> All right, I guess I'll mate with you. Let's get it down and funky. Damn, just watch out, that antenna don't get stuck in the wrong place. Watch where you put that thing. There we go. He got the right antenna in the right hole. He knows how all those media thingies work. That jack goes in that hole and that wire gets crossed with that wire. <laughs> Lol. Yay! Alright, let's hope there's some animals, lots of jackals to feast on when we reach the shop district. Alright. We're in year 12. We're still doing good, I reckon, guys. I just wish our multimedia center had the same speed as a high-speed internet connection, because he's moving so slow right now. Like a freaking grandma that fell down and can't get up. She's actually moving faster than our saber-toothed tiger right now. My god. What is going on? Alright. Yes, animals. Sheep. Meh! That was sheep for... I just kicked your ass, son. Oh, oh, come on, guys. Help me out here. Thank you. Come on. Yep, bring more jackals. More jackals the merrier. I'd prefer hyenas, because they would lighten the mood with a bit of laughter. A bit of comedy. <laughs> oh, silly jackals. Uh, but no, no hyenas here. That's okay. I'll just laugh on the inside while enjoying some bottled water. Holy shit, I just realized I'm at 12 life. Or oh, they're close to us. Uh, 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 God damn it. Come on, guys. Kill that jackal. There we go. But we can't eat it. Kill the sheep. Kill the sheep. One sheep, two sheep, three sheep, dead sheep. There we go. Oh, well, actually, I should be getting clean kills tonight because that's one of the challenge requirements. That's okay. We're doing good. Let's claim this territory from the freaking jackals. Oh, there goes the sheep. 
Alright, let's hide in this grass. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> I'm a huge freaking big ass saber tooth tiger hiding in a patch of grass that barely covers my underparts. Yeah, that's very, very, uh, well, well hidden, yes. They won't know what it is. Well, they won't know if I'm a boy or a girl, because that's the only thing that's being hidden at this stage. Ah, sheep, come here! Ah, there we go. And get my bros on the jackals now. Wow, even my siblings can barely be bothered to move their ass. Damn, no wonder saber-toothed tigers went freaking extinct. Every single other animal overtook them on the way to the ark. They're like, hey, Super 2 Tiger, you need a freaking, you know, you need a ride. You need a ride to the Ark. And he's like, nah, I got this, I got this. You sure the freaking tidal wave, it's right on your ass. It's coming at you right now, son. No, I'm good. I got it. I got it. Yeah, he's dead. Because he's so freaking slow. There we go. At least his claws are nice and fast. Ah. Ah. There we go. Or, you never know, they could have just not been reproducing fast enough. They took so long to mate, they ended up just dying. An entire generation died before they managed to finish the mating procedures. It's very tragic, but true, unfortunately. I saw it on animal planets in my dreams. So it's probably not true. I wouldn't take my, my ramblings for factual information, guys. Oh my god, we nearly got... This area claimed from the jackals. We're doing well, guys. I hope you're all still staying tuned. Ah, there we go. Ah, I've been finding that this is actually uh, my most popular series on my channel at the moment, guys. The old Tokyo Jungle. I guess you guys just like listening to me ramble with no story inter interruptions from other games like. Dishonored or whatnot. Be sure to let me know what kind of guy. Yeah. Be sure to let me know what kind of games you guys like to see me play, man. Because that's what I want to play. I want to play some games that you guys enjoy to watch. Because it makes it a lot more fun in the discussion section, guys. Because that's what I want to do with this channel. I want to have a dialogue with you guys. So make sure you ask me questions. Tell me what you think of the shows, the episodes, what animals you'd like to see next. And yeah, I will get to them. Alright, nearly done. One more piddle point, and we shall have claimed victory from the jackals. Ah, not that <laughs> that victory was ever in question. The only victory that's ever in question is victories that require me to be at a certain place at a certain time. I am definitely one of the most tardiest of the animal kingdom. But I guess, you know, when you're a saber-toothed tiger, you're pretty pimp. You're, you look pretty cool. So it's okay if you take your time to get somewhere. You make your date wait. Because, you know, they're going to be waiting for a long time. Because you're worth it. You know, all those hours at the gym, toning that fine buttock. Not the other one, of course, just the one buttock. <laughs> Could you imagine that? That would be kind of scary, actually. One very tight, firm buttock, and then... Oops, yeah, that would be a, a little uh, unnerving. <laughs> oh my god, what am I talking about? I am being very silly today. I hope you guys don't mind. I'm just so happy. I'm so happy to be back, guys. It's so awesome to be talking with you all again. Alright. Sheep! There we go. Mm -mm 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 what other challenges we got? Just... Oh, oh shit, yeah. Clean kills. We better hide in the grass like a pro. Ah, oh, crap. I've killed everything. And I killed nothing with a clean kill. Crap. Just wait. Let me see here. Where sh Oh, Shibuya Station got nothing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What about in the sewers? I don't think we can even head down there, can we? We might as well go and find out, hey gang? Crap, I hope there's four animals remaining somewhere nearby. Oh, crap! Don't tell me I'm going to fail another set of challenges. I'm feeling an uber freaking face palm coming on, guys. If I fail... A second set of challenges just because I was being 
too happy-go-lucky with my murder spree, then I'm gonna be- Ah! Come on, clean kill! I need a clean kill! Damn it, I've aggroed him. Okay, shh, 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 everyone quiet. Don't let the sheep know I'm standing right in front of him. He can't- Oh shit, I'm gonna die! I need to eat something! <laughs> Crap, I, I wasn't watching my hunger! <laughs> oh my god, four clean kills in one year. I don't think it's gonna happen. Not with this little island of grass tied behind. Or, or, you never know, we might get lucky. Here, come on, give us one, give us one. Yes! Ah, oh, no, he's hiding behind the fence. Can't reach him. He's out of harm's way. <laughs> what movie is it where the, the arm comes through the gate and it's like, ah! I think it was Jurassic Park, the good old raptors, trying to claw the, the smiling face off the children in that movie. Oh, oh, oh. Yes! Clean kill! Only three more to go. Can we pull it off? Can we pull it off? I should have eaten that kitty, but we don't have time. No time for hors d'oeuvres. Come on, move it. Move it, my multimedia wearing friend. Oh my god, we're not going to make it. Oh, I should have eaten the kitty. That's not a phrase you really expect to say on a, a daily basis. Let alone five times in three minutes. No, eat the kitty. Eat the kitty! No, not not the most common of phrases you'll come across in your lifetime. Ah, crap. We're gonna hit 20 years and we're gonna fail another set of challenges. No! Face! Palm! Oh my god, what am I doing? Seeing as I'm noobing it up yet again. Oh, dying. I might as well die while making as much noise as possible. <laughs> Like a boss, alright. Uh, maybe the multimedia just wasn't working for me. Uh, is there anything that's going to increase my speed? A speed of 290? My well-toned ass, that was not a speed of 290. You and I have a very different understanding of what 290 accumulates as, my game friend. Ah, here we go. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, cute color! Yeah, we, okay, we need a... No, no. Need something that goes well with the pink color. No, no. Oh, I, yeah, there you go. Shell crown, shell crowns. Looking pretty snazzy. And a raincoat. <laughs> I'm looking... And kitty paws! There we go! Some nice warm feet for our kitty. Cause like I said, it's getting cold here in Tokyo now, guys. My god, it's approaching on us really, really fast now. And I'm still waiting to get the air conditioning put on. It comes in on uh, Tuesday, but I am freaking freezing my ass off right now. Actually, I'm even, I'm in my kitty, I'm in my kitty jumper, if you guys can see. Isn't it awesome? I love my kitty jumper. Because it's freezing in this room at the moment. But that's okay. The sacrifices I make for you guys are always well worth it. I could be out in the lounge room with a blanket over myself, just playing Tokyo Jungle by myself, but no! No, I would not have it. I, instead, I am in this room freezing my ass off and talking like a crazy person with you guys, because I love you guys and I want to spend as much time as possible. Now we have the time, the opportunity. Yay! Wow. This is the most colorful outfit I think we've seen uh, one of our <laughs> characters wear yet, guys. All right. Uh, what challenge set are we going to fail now? Oh, Yo Yogi Park West. <laughs> okay, I can already confirm that is not going to happen. All right, what about set B? Yamanote Line East. And the most important challenge set is the Shibuya Suburbs challenge set. Change generation two times and perform eight stealth bites. We can definitely do that. So I, I'm going to skip the whole Yamanote line stuff. We're going to say goodbye to that right now. Pardon me, because I'm not going to run back and forth. Pardon me, guys. Ah, getting some uh, gas in my, my stomach. Must have been all that diet food I've got myself on now. But yes, I'm not going to run all the way to Yamanote line and miss out on that challenge set, only to miss out on getting back here in time for our most important challenge set. So I'm just gonna kill some lion cubs, get some presents and hang out here for a while and see if I can enter the sewer. I imagine I can't because I'm pretty big. 
But it's worth a shot. I, I'll go check out if we can get into the sewer or not. Because there's no place I like to be more than up to my knees in ways that the humans laugh for me. Oh, <laughs> Nah, nah, that's not an album worthy song. Ah, I'll put that in the maybe pile, that song. Oh, are you prime? No, you're dirty. I guess I can come back in a little while and maybe you'll be ready. You'll have some glitter on. Alright, can we get in? No! There's a sewer manhole cap on the entrance! Damn it! We're stuck above ground here in the frickin' toxic clouds. Ah, the game doesn't like to make it easy for us, guys. <laughs> yeah, we can't get up on any ledges or anything like that. Ah, oh, crap, and I'm running out of food. Let's move it! Ah, oh, I also found a shortcut over here, which is pretty awesome. There we go. Ah, ah. Come on! <laughs> I've already killed one of my freaking siblings here from lack of food. I don't want to do the same mistake again. Hey, you! Oi! Over here! Come down! Come down here and fight like a doggy man! Ah! No! You just gotta ignore me! Ah! Fine! Oh well, I'm gonna die of hunger yet again. That's okay, we've got one more life up our sleeve! Yes! No! We're not gonna die, guys! Don't be poisoned! Yes, he's not poisoned! Ah! Oh, awesome! There we go! Hunger! We are saved, gang! Ah! Oh, not by the dirty female, however. But we are saved by that little hyena friend that, who gave his life for our longevity. Thank you, hyena friend. I will write your name down in song. Yes, your name will be memoed in infamy by the bards of the animal kingdom. Yes, the ones that always howl whenever we have sex. The ones that go, Hoo! Yeah, they're going to be howling your name whenever I get down and hunky in the future. Uh, come on! What's going on? This is a very unexciting game at this point in time. I can't imagine... Oh my god, you're dirty! I can't imagine. You guys are having so much fun right now, I do apologize. Probably just skip ahead a couple of minutes if you're getting bored. Because I know I am. Just watching myself slowly die. Oh I, I, oh, I thought that was a panda there. Five, four, three, two, one, dead. Ah, uh, maybe the colorful outfit. It just didn't. It didn't work in our favor, guys. Okay, let's try wearing something else. Something a little more manly. Yeah, let's check on our baseball cat. <laughs> Cap. Uh, some hero scarf. There we go. We're looking like a boy scout now. And no, not the raincoat. Cozy sweater. Anything better than the cozy sweater? Maybe we should be chucking on our good luck Toto. That's what we need, guys. We need a little more luck because we're we seem to be running dry on it very, very quickly at the moment. There we go. Beautiful. Come on, Toto. Lead us to victory. Ride us to the well-being of our species, son. You can do it. All right, we've got another female just around the corner here. Please be at least average. If she's average, I'll take her. That's how desperate I'm getting. Oh, come on! I, I lowered my standards! I said if she's average, I'll take her. Why won't you give me a break, game? My god. Ah, Alright. Let's see what else is going on around here. Any food over here? Yes! There's food! Yes! But probably no sexy ladies. What happened? The dots! The dots! I saw dots here! Am I going crazy? I just saw dots on the mini-map! Oh my god, what is going on? No! I can't die of hunger a third time! Ah! I need food game! Come on! Oh, come on. Alright. We gotta strategically move from puddle to puddle to make sure we can extend our life for as long as possible, guys. Hold your breath. Because I'm not going to, because it's probably going to be a while before <coughs> our next meal. But, yep, these puddles are going to tie us over until the next feast, which is just around the corner, guys. Just around the corner, literally. Come on, corner. Show me the money. Show me the beef. Show me the pork on the spit. Ah, god damn it, corner. 
That was very anticlimactic. Oh, but oh, thank you for the dog. Yay! Please be a fresh dog. It is a fresh dog. It's gonna reduce my toxicity by ten. Fantastic. There we go. You just saved the future of the saber-toothed tiger species, my beagle friend, for at least another minute. But that's probably pushing it. Damn, my life is getting really low now. I have to have sex, literally, with the next female I see. <laughs> oh my god. It's really weird, guys. I swear to you. I swear to you. Whenever I play by myself, I have really good luck. I get good challenge lists. I get, you know, a good, uh, a good uh, amount of random chance in my favor. But whenever, whenever I chuck the show on for you guys, Whenever I start recording, it's one, boring, it's two, unfair, and a three, there are no prime females, but fine, come on average female, quick, we don't have much time to have sex, ah, I'm nearly dead, I'm having a heart attack right now, oh, just wait, there we go, some pork, there we go, that'll help my heart attack, ah, <laughs> oh, fantastic, there we go. We're all good. We're all good, honey. You don't have to worry about me dying during sex now. Let's have it on. And I hope our children will have a better chance in life than what we have had. Because we have not had the cards dealt in our favor. But things are going to change. Things are going to change from now on. Alright, so Yamanote Line East. And then Shibuya Suburbs. Uh, let's have a look at the map. Uh, 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 I'm just gonna head. I'm gonna head to the Shibuya so, uh, uh, Yamanote Line East, guys. And when we get there, I'll start heading straight back to the Shibuya suburbs because I'm going to get those prayer beads, and nothing's going to stop me. Even if I die right here, right now, I'm going to load this game straight back up without having to torture you guys and get the prayer beads off screen. And they're going to be magnificent guys I just know it's magnificent all right actually speaking of magnificent there was a shirt I wanted to try wearing this one but I can't wear it apparently all small animals will flee on site cannot be paired with neck accessories torso only oh so if I unequip that can I no oh can, can I what if, what if I take the baseball cap off as well can I wear it now no no? Come on, I want to wear the Mawashi! The Mawashi looks awesome! No Mawashi for me, I guess. Oh, fine. Screw you, Mawashi! Until I can actually use you, then I'll love you. Alright, straw hat. There we go. Actually, we should put on a raincoat in all this rain, shouldn't we? <laughs> That's what the thing is for, raincoat. Alright, do we have any uh, good headwear for rain? Keeps the shampoo out of your eyes the day you no longer need it. You're an adult. Pet cap. No, defense summer. No, I'm more worried about the rain. Anything good for the rain? Nope. Fine. Uh, let's go with the headlamp. Seeing as it's night time. It is night time. There we go. Well, very soon it shall be. All right. What do we got up here? Goats. Beautiful. Just what I needed. Excellent. My evil plans of goat domination are coming to fruition. You two goat. You stay right there. Say cheese! Because that's not what's going to be coming out of you after I'm done with you. Ugh! Damn it, I wanted a clean kill. Oh well. Man, I hope there's some rocket boots you can unlock in this game, because this animal needs them desperately. Desperately, guys, I'm telling you. So anyway, another reason I'm wearing my beanie today, guys, my woolly beanie, is because I just got a haircut, and my god, it is hideous. It is a sight for very sore eyes. Or they will be sore directly after viewing my haircut, because it's quite hideous. Quite horrific, quite horrid, and uh, I'm actually trying to sell the rights to it to a new horror movie called Isaac's Haircut. Yeah, it's going to be great. It's going to be very, very scary. Stay tuned, guys, because Isaac Haircut is going to blow your mind. No, it's not that bad. I'm sure I'll just have it off in the next episode. 
And also, most importantly, oh my god, I can't believe I forgot to talk about it sooner, guys. What do you think about the new artwork for Tokyo Jungle? I've uh, made a great friend in France, Poldry. She's awesome, absolutely amazing. I think you can already tell from the title screen artwork that she has a gift. She's absolutely amazingly talented. Um, uh, yeah, I'll put the link to her uh, personal like art page if you guys want to commission some art off her because she's absolutely amazing. And uh, yeah, I'm really glad and lucky to have a friend like her because I think it's going to be a good part of partnership, guys. She's going to be doing some awesome artwork, hopefully for as long as possible, as many series as we produce. And yeah, it's only going to get better, guys. Like yeah, I'm going to have uh, artwork for pretty much the title screen of every series I do from here on out, as long as she is available. Whoop! Oh, hello. I didn't really mean to choose you, but I, I guess you'll do. Yeah, come on, come with me. I'll find a use for you. I'll put you to work in the kitchen as my second wife, seeing as you're not pristine. But yeah, you'll do for now, I guess. Ah, let's go unlock Yamanote Line East for this challenge set, and then we're going to start heading to the Shibuya suburbs gang. All right, mark ten times. Eight clean kills. All right. I'll see what I can do. And oh, while we're on the note of artwork, guys, if you guys have any artwork that you would like to do for me, would like to do for the channel, please, please, please send it in, and I would be honored to put it on the title screen of an episode. It would be absolutely my pleasure. Uh, again, like this channel is for you guys, so please treat it like your own. Try and make it your own. Style it to your own, and I'll make sure that you are very wealthily rewarded for it. All of your effort will not go unheeded, guys. Like, I will give credit where credit is due. Uh, as always, you know, whenever you see a link in the description of a video for some of the awesome music that is played in the episode, or some of the artwork that you see, please be sure to click on it, send a big thank you and a hello to who made it. And uh, yeah, especially if it's music, Listen to what they've got, guys, and uh, purchase some of it if you like it. And if you like the artwork, be sure to start following them and uh, support them as best you can. Because they really, really would appreciate it, I know, guys. Uh, you know, I, I try to support them as best I can, just like I try to support you as best I can. And, you know, if there's any way I can ever do anything to improve this channel for you guys, be sure to let me know, and I'll do whatever I can to accommodate it. Of course, I can't promise everything in the world to you, but I'll do my best to make sure that whatever you guys want or think is in the best interest of the Jade Warrior Army, that it will be seen done. Whoa! I'll even do that. I'll even see that animals meet in the name of my Jade Warriors. Not something that I would personally thumbs up <laughs> for uh, consumer viewing on a daily basis. But here it goes for entertainment for my Jade Warriors. Jade Warriors. All right. Mm -mm -mm. Let's head on over to the Shibuya suburbs. Cause I want those prayer beads. Those prayer beads. They're gonna be mine. They're gonna hang around my neck all the time. They're gonna look so stylish and bring me luck. I'm gonna love them as much as I love my life on this block. It's awesome. I love this place where I find myself now in Tokyo Town. It's amazing. Everything is just perfect. I've got shopping and gym and everything I need within a foot walk away. Hey, hey, hey. Wow, is that even a song? I don't think I was even rhyming then. Not efficiently, anyway. But, I'm, you know, I'm trying. I'm trying my best. Oh, shit! Don't, a beagle does not kill a freaking saber toothed tiger! That is not how the animal freaking kingdom works! Haven't you seen the Lion King? 
Nice when you're all with you know what I know when you're now when you're now nice when you're seven two tigers don't die from beagles oh no they do not die from beagles see it's in the song it's in the song so beagles can not kill seven two tigers there we go Oh my god! Whoa! They, they, they don't appreciate my freaking world order apparently. Or my taste in movies because they just came in freaking full force. They're even bringing their freaking daddy, a crocodile, to rain havoc on me! But it's just not enough. As I said, I am the vampire of the animal kingdom. So if you ever watch the saber tooth tiger version of the Lion King, it goes something like this: A nice you and your no no vicino mo, a nice ya when ya ya zindiana, like that. No. <laughs> oh my God! I've been eating too much of something. I must have been that stamina jerky. I've eaten too much of that stamina jerky today, guys. Whoa, whoa, bear! Don't go burring your arms to me, son! Cover up! There we go. <laughs> Actually, I'm pretty sure I just uncovered his entire corpse. Damn, this is what I'm talking about. Bigger animals posing uh, a challenge to my saber tooth tiger. Oh, come on, get in there! Oh, oh, whoa, come on, guys! Come on, guys! We're not gonna be freaking pawned by a single freaking bear, are we? Come on! Knock his block off, guys! What is this crap? Whoa! I thought that bear, I swear that must have been a glitch. It looked like that freaking that bear just went woo into the freaking atmosphere like Superman. That was kind of weird. But awesome! Alright. Ah, shit, we're getting low on everything. Quick, eat, 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 come on, eat! There we go. Ah, and we. Leveled up to veteran, there we go. Eat that bear. Eat that bear! You're right, said, eat that bear! There we go. Excellent. How are we going with our clean kills? I think we're still shy a few. But, yeah, we're getting there, we're getting there. Most important thing is coming up, guys. The A challenge set. We're gonna do this, we're gonna pawn it. And we're gonna have fun, fun, fun in the process. Just gonna eat some more stamina jerky. To keep up this comic routine. Whoa! Ah, there we go. Oh, he's poisoned! Ah, yeah, don't eat the poison. Oh, zebra! Yeah, there we go. Now I'm feeling like we're watching an animal documentary. Yeah, guys. Now we're watching how things are supposed to happen. Saber-toothed tigers eating zebras and bears and freaking everything, pretty much. That's the way it's supposed to be. But I'm not going to be happy until I see... I'm not... Oh, shit! I'm not going to be happy until I see some... Oh, you killed my brothers! No, you eat You eat kill my brothers, bitch! You freaking son of a bear! Oh, you suck! Don't you go charging me with... Oh, you... Uh, don't I have, like, a freaking hand pistol or something? I guess he does. He's the one that bears all the freaking arms. God damn bears! Why? Why can I kill a zebra with one hit, but I can't kill wolves with five? God damn it! Die already! I got it! Oh, god damn poison meat and crap and damn! No, I'm not dying today. Not here. Not now. Ah! Yes, kill the panther. Ah, oh, yeah. Actually, I think that's the first time I've ever successfully killed a panther. It's a little bit of a c c accomplishment, if I do say so myself. Oh, Buffalo! Hello, Buffalo! Where are you going, Buffalo? I wanted to say hello, Buffalo. For my bro. You mofo. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, revenge is sweet. Don't be poisoned. Excellent. Ah, oh shit, my poison's getting right up now. Oh, please be an attractive female around the corner. Please be fresh meat, Beagle. Ah, dirty fe- Ah, oh, crap. Poisoned. Crap, it's raining. I'm gonna have to 
reduce my toxicity slightly. There we go. Thank you. Excellent. Let's hope the females around the station are a little more primed. More! Oh, come on! Oh, I wanted to kill that racehorse! Again, a phrase you do not say very often. Oh. Ah! Oh, come on! That was good! That was good! That was good! That was, that was gold! Oh, shit. I'm getting hurt big time here. Ah, oh, god damn it. Oh, my freaking hunger. No! No! You are not stopping me from getting those prayer beads! Piss off! Ah! Go away! No, this is not... Ah! Yes, do that and reduce toxicity. Don't die, please, please, please. Don't die, please, don't die. No! Oh, no! The prayer beads! I needed them to complete my ensemble, guys. Ah, snap! Ah, oh, I apologize. I apologize, my awesome, awesome Jade Warriors. But we're going to have to leave that for another day. Thank you very much for tuning in for the very first episode from my brand new apartment, guys. Uh, it's going to be awesome. A lot more content coming at you guys from now on, so please stay tuned. Please leave a like if you don't mind. If you watch this far, please leave a like. I want to know how much you enjoyed the episode. Uh, leave a... Uh, comments in the uh, yeah, leave your impressions in the comments box below and if you have any questions or requests on what animal i should play next next episode i'm definitely going to be playing a story uh mission though guys and then i'll be taking requests thereafter uh, i also have the giraffe to get to that was requested a little while ago but i'll be definitely doing that in the next uh, next next episode but until then thank you very much for tuning in guys thank you very much for tuning back in for more episodes i look forward to seeing you next time and remember meow meow and oji kai mo o tanishimi ni jane kiyosuke te mata ashite ne bye 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 bye